so this is going to be my March favorites video. I'm so excited to see this month go away because it has been so cold and I'm so ready for spring. This month I have a lot of skin kind of related items, more so than beauty. I also have a jewelry favorite and a baby slash mommy favorite. So if you want to see my favorites, keep watching. Okay, so first up is a foundation that I've kind of rediscovered in my collection just in trying to use up and shop my stash. It's the Rimmel Wake Me Up Foundation. I just love this. It's more of a full coverage. I'd say medium to full coverage foundation. I love how it makes my skin look and it's the perfect color match for me right now. It's number 200. It's soft beige and it does have SPF 15 in it and um, it has really nice staying power. So it lasts, I would say, a full day. So maybe like eight hours, I would say. It gives you a full eight hour wear. Love that. Okay, next is the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. I haven't had this for that long, but I use it every day, and I've quite fallen in love with this. It's, um, I think it's definitely in the brush, like I said in my haul video. It's the brush that really is what makes this product wonderful. It's a full, full volume mascara. It gives you tons and tons of volume without having to put crazy amount of coats on your lashes. If you like um, Makeup Forever Smoky Lash, YSL Faux Seals, Benefit Throw Real, those are some of my favorite mascaras. I really think you will love this because it pretty much does the same exact thing and you cannot beat the beautiful pink metallic packaging. Okay, next, I really feel like these products need a video all on their own. They are the Glam Glow Masks, and I know I've even, I think I've even featured the um, Youth Mud Mask in another favorites video. I've since received these to review and blown away. Whatever I said about the black one, the Youth Mud, um, multiply it by a hundred. That's how much I have fallen in love. So I actually have a whole blog post on the Super Mud because I'd say out of the three, this one is my favorite. I just see instant noticeable results. It's actually quite scary. Um, the amount of results that you do get with this. My husband, I've even turned him on to it when I do my masks. He does it with me because it literally you see, you see what it's doing to your skin. I've never, ever, ever had a product work so instantly where I could actually like see physical results after I use it. It is this really dark um, charcoal-like mask. It almost has like a, a black licorice menthol type smell. I am applying it recently with the Makeup Forever Professional 8N brush. It's basically just a flat synthetic brush. I find that I waste less product with this versus using my fingers. It just picks up the right amount. Um, so I love it for that. I definitely recommend if you get these masks to try using a synthetic or some kind of makeup brush to apply. So let's talk Super Mud first. This product is amazing. You put it on and you can use it as an you can use it as a nighttime mask. You can also use it as a spot treatment, which is why I think I love this the most. I feel like it's so, it's almost like addicting what, because you're seeing the amount of results that it does. I recommend this to everyone. Like, I've recently been telling everyone about it because I just think it's so amazing. It dries on your face to kind of like a hardening effect, much like the Youth Mud Mask. But the coolest thing about this, two things. One, you actually can see, you physically can see your pores and how it's kind of like withdrawing the impurities from your pores. I never realized the amount of pores that I had on my skin and the and the areas that they are. I realized that my pores, my biggest pores, are right around like my nose and like right kind of cheeks, like right underneath my eyes, and then a little bit right between my eyebrows. Um, and it's so funny because when I did this the first time, I was like, I said to my husband, like, you have to do this. I just need, to, I want to see like how it looks on you. His pores are all over his nose and I never noticed it before and he has much bigger pores but I can honestly tell you since using these products because we both use them kind of like the same time his pores have gotten a lot smaller and my pores have gotten less like in the areas that I had the most amount now when I do this mask I don't see them as much so that alone makes me a huge fan of it. And then on top of that, what it does is after it dries, you will see, unless your skin is absolutely perfect, you will see the dark spots, like the little flecks of, you'll actually see the dirt on your face. When I first put this on, I thought they were just like pieces of like seaweed, like in the Youth Mud, youth mud Mask, but reality is this is all the same consistency and you'll see like some parts, it'll dry, you'll see spots and it literally is like magic before your eyes that you can physically see the problems in your skin and where you have dirt and buildup and 
amazing. I also want to just mention the price point. It's $69 at Sephora. A lot of people told me to look it up on Amazon, which I've done. It's about almost $30 cheaper. So definitely if you're going to buy this product because it is expensive and it's literally a product I will continue to repurchase every time I'm running out, I'm going to just buy it from Amazon from now on because you're saving a boatload of money. So that is the youth mud. Then came the thirsty mud. And this is basically like the most hydrating treatment for your skin without going to the salon and getting a hydrating facial. You can use this two ways. You can use it just as a traditional face mask where you put it on, you wait like 10 minutes, it doesn't dry or harden like the other ones do, it kind of just seeps into your skin, it just becomes like a little bit tacky on your skin. Or you can use it as an overnight mask, which I've also done. You put it on and you go to sleep with it and it's just like the most intensive moisturizer you've ever tried more intensive probably than any nighttime moisturizer that you will spend your money on. So those days that your skin just feels really, really, really parched or like you're just, whatever you, whatever products you're putting on your skin are just not enough. Everything you're putting on your skin, it just drinks it up and dries out again. This is amazing. I'm going to be bringing this with me when we go on vacation in June because I know that my skin is going to be really dehydrated from being in the sun and this is definitely a product that I feel like will get it back to being plump and hydrated and moisturized more so than my nighttime moisturizer would do. It smells phenomenal. It smells like it's very beachy. It's almost like a like a coconut slash suntan lotion smell but not really really strong. It's a very soft subtle smell and this is a much lighter color and the consistency of it is much different than the other masks but if you are someone that suffers from really dry skin especially now if you've been dealing with this winter like we have um, it's cold outside it's awful it makes your skin feel raw and then you come inside and your heat's constantly running it just like drains your face of all the moisture this is amazing amazing product and I'm so 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 happy that I've discovered the glam glow because I really feel like they've just revolutionized the whole like skin industry. And then the last kind of favorite item that I have as far as like makeup and skin is this Bite Agave Lip Mask. A lot of people told me to get this when I was complaining about the Josie Marin Argon Conditioner. I just didn't, I wasn't happy with the results of it. And literally I've been using this every single night. I do still like my lip slip and I use my lip slip during the day in my handbag. If you're familiar with the Aquaphor, it's a very similar consistency. I would say it's a little bit thicker than Aquaphor. It, um, it's almost like a Vaseline. It almost looks like Vaseline, but it's a much thicker consistency than Vaseline. And it is all natural. It's not, it doesn't have like the petroleum that Vaseline has in it. My only gripe with this is I wish the packaging was different because it's in one of those um, kind of like a metal tube. It's almost like the same as the um, MAC paints, if you remember the little MAC paints. It's exactly the same kind of packaging. So for me, it's just kind of hard to get product out sometimes because um, you really have to just squeeze. But I just wish the packaging was a little bit softer. I wish the, you know, the outside was just a little bit easier to kind of manage. But it is a very, very, very nice lip treatment. Okay, and then I do have a jewelry favorite this month. And these are the Naomi Cluster earrings from Stella and Dot. And I'm including these in this favorite video because I've literally worn these all month long. I think this is like the first day that I haven't worn these. They are, you guys know I have a huge obsession with studs. And these are a little bit more than a stud, but not quite a full-on, like, massive earring. They're still, I would still consider them a stud, but they're just so colorful and so bright. And I've wearing them, literally been wearing them with everything from a nice black top to go out at night to a white or gray t-shirt during the day when I'm hanging around the house. Like, they just add so much. They have so many beautiful colors in them. They look really nice against your hair, especially when your hair is up in a ponytail. They look really nice. And they also come in a clip, which, a clip-on, which um, is something new that Stella and Dada is doing. They're just like a nice little oomph to your ears and to your, to your whole face. I feel like they really brighten up your whole face. Okay, and then finally, we are at my mommy favorite, and these are probably my most favorite of my mommy favorites that I have shared with you. They are little baby leather moccasins from Freshly Picked. And I love these so much. They are so darling. I bought these for Addison for Christmas. I actually bought her two pairs. I bought her these, which um, are the little sapphire pair. And then I also bought her gold ones for when her feet get a little bit bigger. She doesn't quite fit in these yet. 
And then I also have, these are her newest ones. They're like, I think they're called platinum. It's almost like a silvery gray kind of color. I got these because so many other fellow mommies recommended these to me because when she was a baby baby, like socks would never stay on her feet, never stay on her feet. It was like a full-time job keeping socks on this child's feet. So everyone I talked to said, buy her leather moccasins because they will stay on her feet. And literally they do not come off. They are the only things that stay on her feet. Socks don't stay on her feet. Other shoes that I have don't stay on her feet. These are the only ones and they are freaking adorable. Whenever we're out and she's walking around in these, I get so many compliments. That's the first thing they say, like, not that they love her outfit or that they love her little hair bow. They love her shoes. I'm obsessed with them. They come in every color you can imagine. These have since become, like, my go-to baby gift when someone has a new baby. They will be getting a pair of these from me because they're just so dang cute and they're such amazing quality. They're super soft. They're, they're leather, so they just kind of, like, mold around her foot. They fit. They fit so snug and they just... I just love them so much. They're so cute. And the best part about them is you can put them on boys or girls. They come packaged in this adorable, very nice quality, like, um, cloth pouch with a little button with their little logo, and it's a drawstring bag. And they're just so cute. Everything about them, they're just so, so cute. And the best news about this, and a little surprise, is Freshly Picked is doing a giveaway on my Instagram for a free pair of leather baby moccasins. I will have my Instagram below. Make sure you go follow me and I'll have a post there so you can see exactly how to enter the giveaway and win yourself a pair of adorable baby moccasins. And make sure you follow them on Instagram too. They run giveaways all the time with different bloggers and vloggers and there's just always tons of opportunities to win your own free pair. So that is it for favorites. I hope you guys enjoy this. Thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you soon. Bye.